Yo, it's your boy Straight Boss OV8, and welcome back to another Straight Smoke Gaming video. And it is Monday, and every Monday here on the channel, we dedicate to Red Dead Online. And Red Dead Online just had their DLC six days ago, so we're going to be looking at some of the DLC stuff. And mainly, what we're looking at here is the tools of the trade for the bounty hunter. And when I say tools of the trade, we're looking at these new bolas. New weapons were coming with the DLC, and I think everyone was expecting, like, another gun or something like that. Um, maybe the armored wagon, something. But instead, really, the only new weapon we got are these bolas. And uh, they are sharp looking. Unfortunately, these bolas, this is the best spot that you're going to actually see what they look like, unfortunately. Which kind of sucks, because they are pretty sharp. Uh, but they are pretty pricey as well. Um, we'll be getting into that here just in a second, but there's the original bolas that you get with the first bounty hunter license. Again, these new bolas are with the prestigious bounty hunter license upgrade, which is 15 gold bars and, um, much more costly than the original bolas. You can see there, uh, Gravesend bolas are 75 bucks a piece. Brookstone bolas, a hundred bucks a piece and, uh, the Hawkmouth Bolas, $120 a piece. So these are pretty pricey um, for upgraded Bolas. At least I think they're upgraded. That's what we're going to be looking at in this video as to see if these are new and improved Bolas. You would tend to think so with the steep increase in cost, as you can see there. The regular Bolas are on sale this week at $18. They are normally $30. So keep that in mind is that the regular Bolas are... $30 normally so even the cheapest bola with the DLC it's more than double so we're going to go ahead and test these new bolas out against the original bolas first we're going to go ahead and show the original bola and see how long it actually holds the person uh, I was kind of shocked that it hold it held them as long as it did because I just didn't think it held them that long maybe it's because of the heat of the moment and the, the battle because I primarily use bolas to uh, subdue a target, and then I use the, you know, start firing uh, surrounding enemies to uh, lighten the load to make it a little bit easier. But when we come down to the original bolas, hold the target for about 12 seconds. The bad part about that is, is after 12 seconds, your bola is going to be gone. So you have 12 seconds to clear the area or go up and go ahead and hogtie this guy right away. Now, here in this clip, the big hoss, we're working together here. I'll be using the Grave Send Bolas, which is the newer Bola. He's using an original Bola. We untie them at the same time, hit them with Bolas at the same time, give it a second or so, and we go ahead and do the countdown. And what we find out is that the original Bola versus the Grave Send Bola, the $75 Bola, is about the same, and it's going to be about 12 seconds. So, the Gravesend Bola isn't at all any better than the original Bola, despite it being twice as much money. So, the Gravesend Bola appears to be a pure cosmetic, and a rather costly cosmetic, because if you do let them get out of the Bola, it is a Bola lost. And uh, with these new Bolas, they are, they are expensive. I mean, this is a pretty expensive cosmetic. Um, especially when you really don't get to see it. I mean, you it would be different if you could see it, but you really don't get to see these things. I mean, it's, it's, it's a cosmetic that is well hidden because you don't get to enjoy how sharp looking they are. And they are sharp looking. Here we got the Brookstone Bola. And here I counted down. I got 13 seconds. Um, I was counting a little bit slower, um, like purposely like going one two three i wasn't counting all that quick so i was trying to i was trying my best to make these no, bolas no. like to call these new and improved bolas so i was counting slow um i actually when i did count that originally i counted 14 so when i went to try out these hawk mouth bolas here i was like all right maybe i was just trying too hard to make these bolas better than the original bolas so here on this one with the hawk mouth I counted uh, completely like a normal, and I get about 13 seconds as well. 
So these, um, the Hawkmouth and the uh, Brookstone maybe alone, offered an extra second at best. And that could be completely me messing up and counting too fast or too slow. This is within a second. So these are not new and improved go, <laughs> bolas by any means. They are just new bolas. And they're cosmetic that you really don't get to see all that much. So uh, keep that in mind before you go ahead and buy the new bolas. So I feel like everyone should know that. So that's why we did this video to test them out. And uh, there you have it, go. There you have it, guys. That's the video for today. Shorter video for a change. Uh, make sure you check our last uh, Red Dead Online video as I reviewed the Black Tavero horse. Um, we did a lot of good videos recently. Orb Smoke did a really good Madden video on Sunday. So if you follow us for Madden, go ahead and check that out. There'll be a link in the description for the ultimate bounty hunting guide for these new players that are getting that new bounty hunter license. Also, there'll be a link in the description for us ranking the pistols. Tonight is the last night that the pistols are on sale. So go ahead and check the description for us ranking the pistols and telling you which pistol to buy. All right, guys, we'll see you tomorrow for another Red Dead Online video.